What is up ladies and gentlemen, we're back here for yet another awesome fishing video and uh, in today's video we're going to be doing some good old pond bass fishing. You guys have seen me fish this pond right back over there uh, quite a bit actually, not a whole lot this year in 2019 but you guys, if you guys have been on the channel since last year, uh, you guys have seen me fish this pond and it is, let me tell you, it can, it can be fire. Uh, most times normally it's pretty good we can catch some good fish um, but uh, what I'm starting off with I'm gonna quickly go over that for you guys I've got a uh, little imitator baits swim jig on here if you guys haven't checked these out they're uh, they're pretty juicy uh, then I've got like a little Texas rig on this rod right here and I'm just gonna be flipping around there's some uh, there's some brush out there some tree lay down so I'm just gonna be flipping a little beaver bait probably some Guggen baits because my bag I got a whole stack of Guggen baits and some worms so that's hopefully gonna be juicy and then I've got a little, a little uh little Nico rig right there on my spinning rod so um, other than that that's what I'm rolling with I'm gonna that's what I'm starting off with right now you know I might change it up it is windy and uh, it also just kind of rained too or my dad said it rains last night uh, so it might be a little bit muddy to where I have to go and put on like a chatterbait just so the bass are able to uh, to feel that vibration and locate that bait a little bit better but uh, other than that we're gonna get out there and hope to catch some fish so I got the GoPro on and uh, let's go We got one. Oh yeah, we got one. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. First fish, guys. Look at that. There we go. Right there on the chatterbait. Look at that. Hit him. He hit him pretty far out there in the pond. But there we go. First fish. Took long enough been fishing for maybe 45 minutes or so it seems like and no bites we've been losing fish losing some baits and finally caught one alright you guys got a couple pictures get this guy back whoa whoa he really wanted to go wow so finally the first fish hopefully you guys uh, are still able to uh, to hear me but I switched it up and it seems like it's almost a color thing um, my dad's been throwing the uh, the bluegill colored uh, Z-Man chatter bait, and uh, you guys saw me. I lost my uh, my black and blue imitator baits chatter bait. What the heck? So I wanted to put one on a different color chatter bait than my dad because obviously he wasn't having any luck yet, and uh, so I put this guy on and had two bites within like the first ten minutes. So. That's a good sign. Hopefully we can uh, hook up with some more. Oh, we got one. We got one. There we go, guys. Look at that. Second fish. Second fish. Hit it super close to the bank, too, actually. Look at that. Hopefully you guys can still hear me. It's kind of getting windy out here. But uh, look at that. Second fish on the on the white and gold chatterbait my dad's actually tying one on currently onto his rod out of my box so we'll hope he doesn't lose that one too but you know there we go nice fish all right guys so i'm i'm just going to kind of do like our total weight here i just want to kind of see what the weight of these fish are just under a pound it actually says point it was 0.53 kilograms so i think that's like a couple like a pound or so but nice fish i'm gonna get him back here oh 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 he freaking he flipped off of me okay well there we go that was a tough release but i'm gonna put that into my phone i kind of want to see how how big of fish we can we can get today got one Got one, guys. Third fish of the day. There we go. Right like that on the chatterbait still. Casting out. And uh, 
these they're, they're they're the chatterbait is getting them done like i was saying earlier in today's video i, I was throwing a, a swim jig for a little bit and then a black and blue chatterbait for a little bit and i just wasn't getting anything and my dad as well was getting was throwing a uh a bluegill colored uh chatterbait and he wasn't getting anything either so um and then i tied this guy on and uh a uh, 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 kind of like shad uh colored chatterbait and he tied on a shad colored chatterbait as well and he's had a couple bites he hasn't landed anything yet but he's had a couple bites and i've caught three fish so today just must be like a a color sort of thing or something like that but uh there we go decent fish Alrighty, off, off she goes right back to the depths. Hopefully, hopefully he or she will find their way back. But uh, on the chatterbait, the chatterbait is doing work. And like I was saying before, I guess today is just a color thing. Um, I'm not really sure why. We've got bird blue skies with very little clouds around here. And, uh, and some heavy winds as you guys can hear. But uh, chatterbait, getting it done. Oh my gosh that was insane that was insane guys all right we're just actually leaving right here and uh we got to get home and my dad i was like dad can i take three casts and look at that first cast i catch one i bring it up bring it in here he hits it look at that that's actually that's hilarious i'm gonna put him on the scale because i'm trying to I'm, I'm weighing all the fish that i get and uh we're gonna we're gonna see how big our little bag of fish it's on the other pocket we're gonna see how big our bag of fish is all right point five six so that's i believe just over uh, a pound and a like just about a pound and a quarter so decent fish right there we're gonna get her back and that is gonna be the last fish of the trip and uh yeah that's awesome i'll get you guys back in the car for the outro so it's you know not so windy Alrighty, guys well we are back here in the car sorry if it gets dark we're going under trees and everything obviously but um so today was a great day um i caught all my fish actually on the z white z-man or it's like a white and chartreuse uh, Z-Man Chatterbait with a gold blade. Um, I, I got it actually in a uh, mystery tackle box a while back, uh, last year sometime. It's just been in my box. I've used it quite a bit actually, and caught, caught lots of fish, but um, today I caught four more. So, um, and the thing is, the thing that I also suggest to you guys is uh, obviously not anything like too serious, but um, go out and what how I figured out to catch fish using that bait was trying different colors. And so my dad was throwing a, a bluegill colored chatterbait obviously he wasn't catching anything then um and then i had i started off with a uh, a texas rig flipping ar around a little bit and then i also started off with a, a bluegill swim jig those weren't getting any bites so then i switched over to a different chatterbait color the the one that i caught all the fish on and i started catching fish so just try different colors um and see see what colors work the best you know some colors might catch a couple fish and and my, the bite might turn off for that color and then another color might do really well. So just play around with the colors and uh, the water clarity and that kind of thing. But I caught four fish today. My dad, the pops right here is driving. Uh, didn't didn't get anything. He, he did have a couple on, but they, uh, they were able to get off. But I did uh, take each fish and weigh them except for two of the fish. Two of the fish um i forgot to uh, to weigh them but i just based on the other fish i kind of made like a rough estimate so uh i caught three fish uh three of, i caught four fish three of them i estimated around uh all over a pound um and then one of them was 0.9 
4.94 pounds. So uh, total totaled all of them up today was, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's 4.69 pounds. So decent fish, it was a decent day. Caught some fish, took some pitch, pictures, made a video for you guys. I hope, hopefully you all enjoyed. And uh, that's about all I've got for today. So thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll catch you guys on the next episode of LMB Nation. Peace, guys.